Hi everyone, welcome back to Rise of Flights. Here we are with the career of Alfie West in number four squadron. Uh, feeling a little bit better today, so we get some recording done, which is good. The voice is hopefully, hopefully not as uh, painful as it, as it has been to listen to recently. Um, so today we have a mission. It's a balloon attack. Uh, the date is March the 30th, 1917. Weather report, excellent visibility. And not a cloud in sight. Wind at ground level north northwest, zero meters per second. So when we come to land, we can la land in any direction really. Um, designated pilots: leader will be Andrew Burton. Wingman one will be Joseph Dixon. Wingman two will be ourselves, Alfie West, the scoundrel. Wingman three, Vincent and Anderson, and wingman four, Joseph Armstrong. Primary objective. Follow your assigned route and destroy the enemy observation balloon marked on your map. Our infantry have been taking a beating. It must be brought down. Take off. 0751. So it looks like quite a quick one, really. Um, we'll be taking off to south of Dunkirk from um, Calderkirk Airfield. Heading along the coast. Coming just above Newport here. Um, this is where there's a lot of um, anti-aircraft fire, if you remember. It's quite thick here. Uh, by the the opening of the estuary to the sea, um, and then we'll be heading back as best we can. So, okay, that looks pretty good. Um, balloon attack. Is it worth having a play with a couple of rockets again? So we put some high explosive rockets on there, and uh, and see if we can uh, try and actually. We, we've got to be in a dive, obviously, because they're they're the way they're angled but um we could try the rockets again that could be uh, interesting can only go wrong can't it so um let's head to the aircraft okay here we are sitting in our sop with pup the flare goes up uh, let's crack the throttle get the engine fired cock the gun our rockets on the side no one else has got rockets once again it's just been a alfie's decision Slightly behind them, starting the engine. Just getting it rotating the propeller now to get the oil into the cylinders, and there she goes. Wonderful. Right, lead flight goes. Do a quick um, control surfaces check. Okay, all looking good. Number two is away. Speed in the power. Nose down a little bit. There we go. Get some momentum. Get the tail off the ground. Hold her on the rudder. It's going to be a little bit heavier than them, but we're up in the air. And the next one is coming up as well. Fantastic. I do love these old words. They're such a joy to fly, aren't they? They're so simple. And yet they all have their own unique characteristics, which you've got you've to get used to, which is always interesting. Right. So we are the rocket ship, and um, we are going to form up and start heading along the coastline then to Newport and see if we can attack this balloon. Hopefully this time with our rockets. It's going to have to be quite an angle if you look at the, the, where the rockets are. So we need to be the balloon, probably just on the uh, the edge of the top wing. Should be fun. Hi everyone, welcome back. Just a little status update. Um, we've fallen to the back of the pack. <laughs> there they are there. Um, we are a lot slower with these rockets on board. Um, you can see the four aircraft in front of us. Um, but also you can see the front line, the, the great brown splurge that is the front line. And down there, just above the gun, you can see observation balloons now. They might be on our side of the line, so they could be friendly ones. Can't, difficult to tell range. Uh, from this from this distance, but um, you just see we're flying along the coastline. It's a little bit um, hazy up here, but lovely. 
Not a cloud in the sky. Well, a little bit of. I don't know my clouds. A little bit of high high cloud anyway. Um, yeah, we got another observation balloon over there. We've got two there. I'm guessing they're on our side of the lines. And we'll need to pass through those. But um, yeah, so far, um, nothing much to report. It's just, <laughs> it's just that we're so slow. We are so slow. I can't even. I'm on, on max revs, and I can't even keep up with these. Um, oh, it's more observation balloons loading in from the far distance now. So maybe it's the one right in the um, target now they're going for. Uh, we'll see which one they go for, and if they um, defeat it, then uh, we can always target another one. And obviously, we're here to attack a specific balloon, which is giving artillery uh, coordinates and, uh, for our allied positions. Um, but if we take out another two or three along the way, I'm not supposing anyone's going to mind too much. So, um, yeah, it's probably going to take me another 20 minutes to get that. Although, actually, no, we're, we're closing in pretty quick now, so it's not too bad. Uh, let's, let's see who they're going to go after. Oh, we've got an aircraft up high. Oh, is there more aircraft up there? Are they my, no, my buddies are here. Okay, we got some, a group of aircraft up high. They are getting the attention of some ACAC. It's we're so close here. Look, front and um, the front lines of both sides are so close to each other. It's very difficult, you know, to say who's firing at who. Um, so that that flak could be, or that ACAC could be um, friendly fire going for enemy aircraft, or it could be enemy. Um, flat going for friendly aircraft, I just can't tell. They do look a little bit Newport-ish, you know, kind of like the radial engine rather than the um, it's not really an inline engine of the uh, the Albatross. Uh, they turn it up and they're attacking okay, not sure. Right, we need to get rid of these uh, rockets and then we can maybe go and check out there is some sort of dogfight going on there so there are enemy and friendly aircraft it's quite the furball in fact and they're, they come right for us they? right let's um let's target the balloon we'll get rid of these rockets Okay, <clears throat> there's the balloon. Let's try and get there quick. Try and get below her as well. Oh, there's a balloon down there as well, but this is the one I think. Yeah, that's got. That's the one we're going to go for. Oh, truck AR, please. <laughs> that's <was> scary. <laughs> I don't want to rip our wings off, so. Oh, where's everyone gone? Over there. Where's he gone? There it is, right. Okay. Now I don't want to get too close because I don't want to get caught in the old uh, rocket fire. Now they will, of uh, uh, you know, drop. I should imagine they're not going to go on forever. So if we line this up, prepare to fire. Right now. Got it. Get out of there. Nice. Right. Caught the gun one more time. Let's go in and uh, join this furball. Where are these um, aircraft? Lots of ACAC. There they are. I can see it. 
bear calf squirming about over here. Come on, Alfie. Let's get in. Let's show them what a street fighter we are. Let's stay high for a moment. We've got an aircraft up here. Don't want to give anyone else the advantage. Hopefully we'll be... Ooh. Oh, hello! <laughs> oh my goodness me. Hit the brakes and fly right by. Not quite, but... In we go. There he is. Oh, there's two of them here. Oh, hang on. I'm getting slightly disorientated. Oh! He winged us. So, right, we're still in the fight. Is that an albatross on our tail? Thankfully one of our buddies has got him. Right. Hello, sunshine. You want to take a pot shot at me, do you? Don't mind if I return the favour. Losing blood. Oh, we are a... We are a... Oh, God. He's smoking. We did say, people were saying in the comments, Alfie is a potential murderer. Changed his name, he's a bit of a scoundrel, a bit of a, bit of a, you know, bit of a badden, as they say. So will he be chivalrous? No, like heck he would. He's going to ply the jerry with as much hot lead as he can. I think I might have killed the pilot on that one. Oh, hello. Right, target number two has just come to uh, interview. I think I think that one's dead. He's just flying straight and level, so I think I've got the pilot. Right, I don't know how much damage we've done. Or well, we've had done to us, should I say. That's a friendly. Okay, I just got this um this blurred um loss of blood vision is not aiding me. There he is. It's down there, right? Okay. It's not helping my already poor observation skills. Hello. Oh god. They can. T I forgot how quickly albatrosses can turn. They get right. They turn so ah, so tightly. Problem is because it's so blurred. It's very difficult to see who is friendly, who is not, until you get right close to them. I'm on his tail now. On the rudder. Nose down. I think. It's probably better manoeuvres, but... Well, I can see another balloon going down in flames. Oh, he's going wing over. Here's something over here. There's loads of aircraft. That's in. No. Oh, I've lost him. 
Okay, he's in trouble. I've lost him. To me, is my vision getting worse? Am I losing too much blood? Do I need to be going home? I can't see. Someone there. That's a friendly. Oh, there's a friendly. That's a not so friendly. Oh, he's on my tail. No, he's below me. Yeah. I don't want to go into their dogfight because that could end horribly for me. There's another one there. Oh, engine. No, I just. Oh god. Okay. Oh, it's on my tail. I don't think he's actually wanting to get on my tail though. So. Back on his tail? No, that's a friendly. I think I'm be I'm think I'm more of a hindrance than I am with my um limited visibility. And half of me is wondering if I should just Oh god, back off below. Yeah, I'm going to get out of dodge. I think, I think, um, with my wounds, oh, and me stalling, oh, I don't ram that aircraft. Okay. We're going to get out of dodge. We're going to get out of dodge. I can't help here. I think our aircraft's actually taking some damage. We're taking a bit of damage. I'm stalling all the time. We're heavier than everyone else. Uh, I'm going to lead them to it and make our way as best we can to go and get some medical achievement. Don't forget, we are Alfie West. We are selfish. We'll be, we've done a little bit to get rewards. We've attacked the, the enemy, but ultimately, we look after ourselves, and we're going to make it back as best we can. So we're going to make a beeline for base now. Good luck, boys. If you don't make it back, I'll have your ration of gin. Don't worry. Right, we've scrubbed off a lot of the uh, the altitude now. Base is just behind those rocket rails, and uh, we'll uh, start to come in, blipping the engine as we go. Don't really need to because we're on literally idle. Going over the trees now. Aim for between those uh, hangars because I can't really judge the distance to the ground because of the. Uh... Oh. oh, there we go. That's the ground there. Right. Cut the engine. Stick back to drag the uh, skid into the ground. <sighs> and Alfie West has survived another sortie, just about. I think it's straight to the medical wing with Alfie. And here we have it. Statistics. 
V for victory. Primary objective completed. Uh, after 38 minutes and 4 seconds. Alfie West landed but was wounded. Shot down one balloon and one aircraft kill. Andrew Burton wounded but landed. Oh god, we were, it's a bit of a mauling, wasn't it? Uh, no other uh, credits to his name. Joseph Dixon uh, was still in the air, but um, again, no credits to his name. Vincent Anderson sadly was um, crashed and was killed with no credit to his name. And Joseph Armstrong, uh, Payne crashed but survived, which is good. So only Joseph Dixon was um, in the air at the time. So Andrew had already landed at this point, it would seem. Probably found a bit of uh, a friendly airfield or probably just touched down in a field on our side of the line. That was a tough mission. Uh, we have been awarded the Costaguer uh, with the Bronze Palm. Nice. Okay, thank you very much. Um, you were taken to the hospital to receive treatment for your wounds, unsurprisingly. Yes, yes indeed. We shot down um, Joachim Fuchs, <laughs> should we say, in his Albatross D3. Nice. Good stuff. Two wounds in action and a loss as well. Tough days. Have a look in the squadron room. Um, that at least puts us um, towards the top. Andrew Burton, who was going along like crazy with six missions, four aircraft kills and a balloon kill, with three hours, 53 minutes experience. Um, we've now moved up to second with two aircraft kills and three balloon kills. Um, and we've done three sorties and three successful sorties at that. And then we've got Paul Lawrence with an aircraft kill. And then all we've got then is Paul Bradley with a, with a balloon kill. So, yeah, very inexperienced um, squadron, number four squadron. We're doing our best. We're learning as we go. Uh, Alfie West is up to 410th in the uh, number four squadron's achievements of other careers. Or player careers, should I say. Uh, we've got two sort with pups, which require one day's work. We've got one which requires four days' work. And we've got 11 fully functioning, airworthy crates to go. Okay, into our personal room now for Alfie West. There we go. The confirmation of our two aircraft kills, both Albatross D3s, Paul Kaiser and jo Joachim Fuchs. Um, and there we are. Global statistics, 20,504th, which is pretty cool. And then we got our Costaguer with our bronze palm as well. So he's building a reputation slowly for himself as a bit of a dead eye. He managed to take down a hot air balloon with rocket power. Which is pretty cool. Uh, was wounded. Still shot down an aircraft before bailing. Uh, well I say bailing. Returning to uh, returning to base and bringing the aircraft home. So yes. Another successful day. And another, another black spot removed from Alfie's career maybe. Who knows. He's slowly making a good reputation for himself. As a bit of a fighter pilot. And vanquishing some of his... Uh, skeletons in the cupboard shall we say and we're gonna leave it there until next week thank you ever so much for watching i hope you're enjoying alfie west's career it's something a little bit different i'm loving the sop with pup it's a wonderful aircraft very versatile um a little bit scary against the albatrosses but uh still good fun thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed it please hit that thumbs up and if you haven't already hit that subscribe and tickle the bell so you get all the latest notifications when the next video is released thanks so much take care Bye bye